Now let's take a look at some daily chart examples on how to time our way into high flying stocks that are um, doing great on a daily chart. This is going to be fun because this is where uh, swing traders uh, make uh, you know a lot of their money. It's fun. It's exciting to watch stocks uh, take off in front, you know, in front of your eyes. So what we want to do here is remember the underlying principle and the theory is that we don't want to chase any stock, but we want to find our way perfectly into the stock, and hopefully, preferably, we want to start making our money from day one. So, on our first case study, I'm gonna have five examples for you today. We're gonna to look at ANSW, um, which had a again on a daily chart. ANSW, which rallied from five dollars to around eight in a couple of days, it settled down. You don't want to, you know, buy the stock just because you want to wait for it to make a new high, and it did make a new high right there. And you want to buy it always watch for above average volume and you can see that was above average volume right there so you so now assuming you bought that stock there you 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 know you can either hold on to it until you find other selling um, uh, indicators um, giving you a sell sign or you just you know you take your part some partial profit or you know if you want to add new money into the stock or if you had missed this move or you can or all you need to do is wait for it to settle down so the stock makes a new high right there and then on day on day one that is our day one and then the second day becomes day two of rest day three was a rest day the stock took off on day four perfect again um, you want to wait for at least a fourth day breakout and this was a perfect one and notice the volume at this point of the stock uh, breaking out on day four was one of the heaviest volume going back to when the stock IPO'd. So this was a very significant timing for the stock. Um, if I remember right, this is um, where our subscribers got in just around seven dollars. So we timed this entry perfectly at Moada.com. There was another intraday or daily buy point on the fourth day right here. So you buy the stock there probably around $11 and within one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Around eight days, you had more than tripled, uh, not tripled your money, but you had doubled your money and, and then some. So wait for the stock to settle down, guys. There's no need for you to put money and chase a stock. Just wait for you to settle down uh, on the fourth, at least on the fourth day, you can always get yourself back in. Now let's um, move along to the next example. And on this example, I just threw in something to kind of throw you off a little bit because you probably might be thinking that all stocks need to be making new highs. I'm going to use a, a case study of BOT to show you that you can use this fourth day breakout in many situations. Here is a stock that was trending lower. You can see by the blue line, trending lower, trending lower, trending lower. At some point, you see it crossed over the blue line. Again, notice the volume there was heavy when the stock jumped to new, to new um, above the blue line. Notice the volume was above average, which is always an indication that the market likes what's um, what's going on and then the stock mix after breaking out of this range right here it has a nice rally and then it has a close a daily close there it settles down on day two day three and then takes off on day four so you can use this in many instances in this instance the stock was not making was not making a new high yet we use our fourth day breakout um, theory or principle to get our way back in the stock the stock again briefly the stock rallies for two days settles down and probably after a week of two of red a week or two of break um, it takes off again and I bet you this was on heavy volume if I scroll down yes you find that the stock broke out on heavy volume so use um, you know patience when trying to find your way into quality names